Cave of Desperation, the simplified version. First things first, I want to explain an important mechanic. When the person tanking runs away, the boss is going to do an AOE splat. I did it on purpose to demonstrate what it looks like. And even when you run away with the larva, again, it's not recommended because it'll do the AOE splat. So I purposely did that to show you what happens. And if it does happen, you know exactly why. Now let's talk about the larva mechanic. In my opinion, it is not worth trying to tell someone how to do it. It's very awkward. It's, it's very hard to pull off if you're not coordinated. Just tank it. If you're the tank, beef up. And then when it pops you up, there you go, just solid. If you're the DPS or anybody in the back, once you're lifted up, just fly, just like that person did. You won't take any fall damage. Again, if you're the tank, just use your cooldowns because when you get lifted, the boss is gonna swipe at you. And for the rest of you guys, just fly in midair and you're solid. Don't worry about the larva mechanic. It is <laughs> it simplified guide, guys, simplified. The next mechanic is gonna be when the boss spawns eggs on these little mounds here. What I usually do is I like to run to it. Now you could use a pillar, it does spawn, and you might see players do that, but again, simplified, right? I don't like telling people to do this because there's potential for them to fall and mess it up and we don't want that. Look at that, they're already on the ground, they're already falling. This is why I just say run to it because it's way easier and nobody can really screw that up. Once you run to the pillar, the ant will spawn, fly to the ant, well not the pillar, but the mound. Um, the ant will spawn, run towards the ant, kill the ant. Once the ant is dead, drop back down and continue to fight the boss. Be careful not to go underneath the boss because it will smash you and kill you. So don't do that. The two takeaways from this video is to ignore the larva. Make sure you beef up if you're the tank. And if you're not, make sure you fly down after you lift it up. And the second part, ignore the pillar that rises. Just run to the mound and be ready to kill it. That's all you have to do. You have enough time. Just like my other videos, I can't stress enough. These are simplified guides. I'm not here to talk about every little small mechanic because it doesn't matter. I want to give you the mechanics that you can explain to new players or to players that might not speak a lot of English if you're an English speaker. And so that way everybody can be on the same page and in the dungeon. If you're looking for a specific dungeon, playlist down below, I have them all covered. And until next time, you know what I always say. Thank you guys for doing what? Popping often, will often. Yeah, yeah.